So we were talking of steroids. Uh, so which patients with diabetes can be prescribed steroids? Is there a particular um, uh, type which is better than the other? And what is the ideal dose and duration? So uh, very good question, madam. That uh, we, we one should always weigh uh, what is there. You know, now if the steroid is life saving, like in a COVID nineteen infection, or in a in in a in a pregnant lady where you're looking for maturation of the lung. You know, you have to give it. There's no two ways about it. Whether the sugar is 300 or 400 or 500 doesn't matter. If it's going to save that life, we need to give the steroid. So steroid also of, of two or three types. The most commonly prescribed injectable is hydrocortisone, which is shorter acting. It works for 12 hours. The, the longer acting one, the prednisolone and the dexamethasones, they act for 24 to 40 hours. So based on what type of steroid and what dose is given, you will have to modify. Many a time, when you are in a higher dose, you will require insulin. If, if, if the dose is lower, you may require oral medications, but you will require insulin. But we should never withhold a steroid to a patient because he has diabetes. Because that, that steroid could be life-saving for that patient.